Thank you for joining us here in um, sunny Los Angeles. It was 85 degrees today. It was, be it was, it was just nice, and, and we should enjoy it because, I don't know if you read this, but they, there's a new study that says the heat index, which is basically the measure of how hot it feels. They say that by the year 2050, the heat index will be literally off the charts. It'll be so hot on the hottest days, they won't be able to chart it. <laughs> Can't they just make new charts because of... <laughs> Can you imagine that? If somebody says, uh, how hot is it going to be today? And they're just like, well, it's real. Too, I don't know. <laughs> Over the next three decades, we'll have days on which the heat index is so extreme it becomes incalculable, which seems bad. But there is hope, according to the same report, we can avoid the worst case scenario if we reduce emissions from fossil fuels. Unfortunately, the fossil who is currently fueling the White House doesn't care about that because <laughs> he won't be around in 2050. He would probably brag about breaking the heat index. So it's up to us to do our part to cool people off. And with that said, we are gonna, we have something special tonight. Let's go outside to Guillermo, who's on Hollywood Boulevard. Hello, Guillermo. How are you? Good, good to me. Guillermo, what is the heat index out there right now? It's muy caliente, very muy hot, caliente, Jimmy. Muy caliente, yes. Uh, so tonight, Guillermo is going to give a pedestrian who needs one a summer haircut, correct, Guillermo? That's right, Jimmy. Uh, all right, so round somebody up and we'll start chopping away. Let's see, who do we have out there? Oh, wow, that's great. <laughs> well, what is your name? Gus. Gus, where are you from? I'm from McAllen, Texas. All right, so Gus, you have a lot of hair, don't you? <laughs> Yes, I do. Yeah, have you always, do you always wear your hair like that or do you sometimes have it short? Uh, this is my first year with long hair, so I was like, I'll give it a try after seeing Aquaman. And? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Aquaman. <laughs> okay. And what kind of cut are you looking for today? As if it matters, it really doesn't matter, but <laughs> what are you thinking today, Gus? Um, i thinking he's gonna get creative. <laughs> Yeah, well, why don't you get started? What do you have there? What do you got, clippers? Yes, Jimmy. And what number are you going to go at? I think it's number four. A number four, all right. So start at number four. And oh, boy. Is it actually coming off? Because it doesn't look like, oh, it is coming off. Yeah. All right, Gus, he's working on, got a number four going on here. Have you ever had a, a haircut on the street before? Never, it's my first time. Do you have any like important dates coming up? Maybe a wedding or a court date, custody <laughs> hearing, etc. I had a job interview, but I'm not gonna put that one aside. <laughs> yeah, all right. What kind of work are you looking for, Gus? <laughs> <laughs> one that pays. One that pays. <laughs> all right, all right, well keep at it, Guillermo. We'll check back in and see how it comes out, okay? That's okay, Jimmy. Okay, very good. All right, there's Guillermo cutting hair on Hollywood. All right, let's go back out to the boulevard and see how the haircut is going. Oh, it looks, hey, I have to say, Guillermo, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah, I think so, Jimmy. I think I'm doing a good job. Give, give Gus a mirror and let's see. Yeah. I don't know, the audience doesn't seem to agree, but I'm surprised. I think Gus, Gus, what do you think? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you love it. It's okay to cry if you need to. <laughs> I think it looks pretty good. I think that's going to be great for the job interview. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. All right. Sold. <laughs> you have any regrets at all, Gus? Not at all. Not Thank at you, all. Jimmy. All right, very good. <laughs> Would you recommend Guillermo to a friend? <laughs> I sure will. All right, let's get another uh, customer in there. And here we have, what is your name? Hi. I'm Joseph. Joseph. Now, Joseph, you are a handsome young fella. How old are you, Joseph? I'm 19. 19 years old. What do you do for a living? I'm an actor. Oh, you are? OK. All right, so act happy when we're done with this haircut. <laughs> Guillermo, unfortunately, Joseph, Guillermo's about to go on break, so I'm yeah. going to pass you off to one of our junior stylists. <laughs> Jack, I've never seen a barber taller than the barber pole. Yes. How are you? What's your name? Joseph. Joseph, you. that's yeah. Shaquille O'Neal. He's going to be cutting your hair, OK? You yeah. Pay attention. Yeah. All right. <laughs> your hair is about to go kazam. Shaq. Shaq, have you ever given a haircut before? Yes. 
Whose hair have you cut? LeBron James. You did? <laughs> Are you the one who, who gave LeBron that perfect hairline that... Wow, this, this is a wonderful this look. This right here is called the arm rest. <laughs> See, I can rest my arm right there. One more. This is called the mini mouse, what we're looking at right here. This Yo. is not a mohawk, this is a whole mock. <laughs> Back is mohawk. It's not like the sides right there. It right really there. is the opposite of a mohawk right yep. now. Wow, I'm that's a, that right this, I, Shaq, you've created a new hairstyle. This it is, is incredible. It's a little bit like Alfalfa from <laughs> The Little Rascals if he was oh, yeah, beaten yeah, and yeah. robbed. All right, Shaq is, you know, doing a little bit. Shaq, you're, Shaq, those scissors look like nose hair clippers in your hands. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Shaq, that is a beautiful job you did there. This is absolutely... <laughs> you know, it's nice. It's like if there were a, a tiny little plane would land right on that run one day on your head, Joseph. Yeah. Joseph, Shaq is going to show you what your hair looks like, all right? And you tell us, give it... <laughs> Looks good, right? What do you Looks think? Good. You like it? <laughs> that's dope. Shag, maybe so Joseph doesn't have to explain it, you could um, sign, autograph that little stripe on top of his head. It's not a stripe, it's a work of art. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that is beautiful. Well, very well done, Shag. And Joseph, yeah. Anybody uh, else want to cut? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Jack, please do not attack the crowd there on Hollywood Boulevard. If you like that video, then put a ring on it. Click the subscribe button below. Uh-oh. Oh, oh.